children let's talk about rahul let us read the first sentence rahul is a brave boy second sentence rahul helps everyone third sentence rahul's parents love him now children here if you will see again and again i am using the noun rahul 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 children now i can replace this noun using a pronoun now let us see how let's see the first sentence again rahul is a brave boy now second sentence is again talking about rahul rahul helps everyone children rahul is a boy that means male gender and for male gender we can also use he or she we can use he so we can replace the noun using the pronoun he he helps everyone now come to the third sentence rahul's parents love him children now here when you will see i am again using the naming word rahul rahul is repeated again so what can i do children now you have to remember one thing the sentence which talks about a person's possession or his personal qualities or his personal attributes we can replace that naming word with the pronoun his his parents love him now if you see him here also refers to rahul so he his him are used for the male gender and these are your pronouns which are used in place of noun hi friends my name is priya i am skipping i am enjoying myself in the park you want to know more about me okay so my teacher is here to tell you something about me children now we are going to talk about priya look at priya she is looking so happy so let's read the first sentence priya is skipping priya is in the park priya's shoes are red in color now children here again if you see we are repeating the word priya again and again and all the three sentences are talking about the same girl who is priya so what we can do yes we can replace the naming words with the pronoun let's see how we are going to do it now the first sentence priya is skipping second sentence priya is in the park now the second sentence is again talking about priya so instead of the naming word priya what we can use yes very good we can use she because priya here is a female and for female gender we use the pronoun she she is in the park now come to the third sentence priya's shoes are red in color now children here if you will see we are talking about the personal belongings of priya something which she has of her own so remember when we talk about a person's personal belongings or personal attributes we use the pronoun for female we use the pronoun her very good the sentence becomes her shoes are red in color so the pronoun she and her are used for the female gender